All right, buddy, and welcome back to Bayou Time. This is an update of a story we brought to you on Monday, including a deputy-involved shooting that happened within the Homa City limits. On October 4th, shortly before 11.30 a.m., Homa police responded to a shooting on that Monday at the intersection of Canal Street and Bond Street, or Tunnel Boulevard, which is really close in those areas. Upon arrival, they discovered a shooting involved the Terrebonne Parish Sheriff's Deputy. An investigation continued. Homo police detectives arrived on the scene uh, per that request from the uh, Terrebonne Parish Sheriff's uh, Tim Saunier and Homo police investigated that incident. During the investigation, it was developed that the Terrebonne Parish Sheriff's officers handled a disturbance at the business on Tunnel Boulevard where the subject was wielding a knife. He was identified as Shane E. Hartman of Cleveland, Tennessee, but he resides in a hotel in New Iberia. When the deputies responded, they disarmed Shane Hartman of the knife. He was checked out by medical personnel and released. Shortly thereafter, a second complaint came in of Hartman impeding traffic. At this point of contract, contact was made again with the deputies and Hartman requested to be transported to a business within the city limits. When deputies arrived at that business, Shane Hartman refused to exit the parole vehicle. A struggle ensued between Hartman and deputies where he disarmed the deputy of his taser. Shots were later fired, striking Hartman in the upper torso, as well as a deputy in the hand. Both were transported to a medical facility for treatment. Later that day, he died of the injuries sustained in the shooting. Homa police has learned that the Terrebonne Parish Sheriff's Officer's deputy uh, received moderate injuries to his hand. At this point, an investigation is ongoing as to further information and will be released as it developed. Bayou Time will continue in just a moment.